Pussy helps out. It was summertime on the island of Sodor. Yippee, said Pussy. Pussy enjoys looking in the sunshine. And you like being able to say hello to a friend. Hello, Nelson, Pussy called. Nelson was so busy he could barely have time to honk back. He was killing machines everywhere. From the yard to the sites. And then all the way home. Day after day, Nelson was carrying, carrying, carrying until his axles ache. Just once he thought to himself, I like to be carried. That night, Nelson had a dream. She dreamt that she was sailing with the countryside. The breeze was blowing, he was enjoying himself, and he realized that he was being carried. The next morning, Mr. Jenny woke Nelson, Nelson, Nelson from his dream. Thomas had had an accident that made way of crossing. So, Mr. Jenny, so Thompson had an easy to take him to the repair yard. Nelson hoped his friend Thomas was all right. When Nelson arrived, he saw Thomas come off the rails and broke in a wheel. Thank you for coming, Thank you for coming, Chuck Thomas, 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 cheerfully. We'll get you back, we'll get you back in, in no time, time replied Nelson. Nelson had, Nelson had to be very careful. He never carried a steam engine before. Thomas is driver, and Nelson's operator set to work at once. Nelson struggled and he went to put Thomas aboard. You're heavier than a bulldozer and the steam wall were put together, Nelson explained. Thomas was surprised. I'm only a tank engine, he said. Soon Nelson was on his way, and Thomas was heavy. Nelson had to work very hard. He puffed, and he chuffed, and pulled. Soon they were making excellent time. Thomas was impressed. You are a very good carrier, said Thomas. Thank you, said Nelson. I pull four cars for passenger cars all day long, said Thomas. Be good to be carried for a change. I want to be carried sometimes, said Nelson. But you will be big enough to carry me. Soon they arrived at the repair yard. Well done, says the top of hat. You are really useful truck. Nelson was tired, but he felt very proud. You could leave Thomas on the railroad, says the top of hat. Miss Jenny needs you back at the yards immediately. Yes, sir, said Nelson. I'll drive as fast as I can. That won't be necessary, says the top of hat. I'm taking you, cried Pussy. Nelson could not believe what he had heard. Soon Nelson was a boy pussy's well loader with a shout out. Thank you everyone. They were off. Percy was giving Nelson a splendid ride. It was magical as he has tree. The sky was blue. The trees were green. All Nelson had to do was to work it with the beautiful soul of countryside. It's usually we buy. Excellent, excellent day, said Nelson cheerfully. Percy was happy. His friend was enjoying himself. Choo choo.